Hey everyone, this is Aaron with Kite Paddle Surf and I'm so excited to be doing this review on the Ozone Chrono V3 Part 2 of the series. This is an amazing free ride foil kite and I'm going to show you all the cool features on it. So right away you launch it, you're going to notice that the turning speed of this kite is going to be a little bit slower than your LEI kites. But once you learn how to adjust to it, you're going to have no problem flying this kite. Start edging up wind, you're going to notice right away that this kite wants to go right to the edge of the window and it wants to go upwind quickly. What took you three, four reaches on another kite, one, two reaches, you're all the way up to where you want to go, which is great for the free ride rider who wants to do a lot of tricks, ends up downwind, and then wants to get back upwind to do more uh, tricks. As far as jumping, this is an amazing boosting kite. It jumps so high and the float is just awesome it'll just carry you down at a nice slow speed so you're able to do numerous tricks whether it be grabs uh, rotations or myself just learning how to do board off tricks it's great for that um, for the foil border now this on this kite i did not do any foil boarding but as you know many people love the foil kites for foil boarding because they do so well at um, getting out in light wind conditions speaking of light wind this is my um, one of my favorite reasons of having this kite is because I'm able to go out in marginal conditions that would be difficult in an LEI kite. And with this kite, you're just able to just get up and ride and not even have to think about what you're doing. As far as the type of rider, this per, this kite would be best suited for an intermediate to an advanced rider because of there's just a lot more going on with this kite. As far as launching it, you're going to need to pay more attention to it. And the power, it produces a lot of power. This is an 11 square meter kite that I'm riding and it's equivalent to some of the 14, 15 meter kites. So it has a lot of power behind it, which is, you know, it can be daunting for someone who's new to kiting. So uh, apart from that though, this has just been an amazing kite, probably my favorite kite that I've um, tested this year for 2018. So uh, please, if you have any more questions, give us a call at Kite Paddle Surf. We'd love to answer them for you.